Day 13. Well, uh, I said I was gonna only upload on the 31st. Well, I uh, recovered a bit more quickly than I thought from my operation, so I'm back at it again. And they expanded the rescue space a bit more. Alright. Hmm. Do we have a lot of pup drive right now? Yeah, but we can learn super buff, meaning Orchi can carry things for a hundred pigmen, and we can learn. Should we learn doggy paddle level three? No, we should learn chomp level two. Haven't upgraded that in a while. We still have a lot of learning stuff to do, but that should be fine. Alright, next up we're gonna talk to Russ again. And see what we can buy. Oh, we've got new gear available. The treasure gauge plus. Total amount and... Oh, finally. Okay, I have to buy this. Total amount and location of all treasures. Gunk busters. Coated in sealant that repels the gooeyest of gunk. <gasps> Ooh, that's useful. Thermal, anti-electrifier, triple threat. I have to buy everything at one point, but I think for now it's fine. Come back when you need anything. <laughs> oh yeah, we can receive some more things for finding 75 creatures. Ah, uh, let me know when you found 100. This guy gives us some raw material for 50. Wow, okay, that's good. Collecting treasures. All right, so last part. Updating your look. Ah, wait a second. Rescue leaflings. I thought... Like, okay, maybe he had a side mission. And he did. You? You've bloomed a lot of pigment, they're so beautiful. Okay. Mission complete. Oh, I'm supposed to do more. Okay, there's more side quests here. I'm sure you're busy, but can you search for the students? Oh, I'm supposed to rescue all the club members. Alright. You? Okay, it doesn't have a side mission yet. Currently researching the connection between Pikmin and Whistle. When your squad gets bigger. Ah, this guy gives us collecting flalic bulbs. Collect six of them. I think it, you can collect more than seven, which would give you a hundred pigment in total. But you won't get more than a hundred per, like, in the entire field. Okay, this guy doesn't have a side mission yet. So a lot of side missions. Okay, that's all. Let's go back to Serene Shores. So, we've got 42%. Last time we cleared the horrible dungeon of the Water Wraith. And this time, we might be taking on the Disco Dungeon. There's 86 treasures in this world. We've got nearly half. Alright, I have to organize myself. I have to get the melon today, at least. And I have to clear a few dungeons and dandoris. There's also more onions. I think the rock onion should be here. 
And well, the rescues are gonna be here too, so we'll see. Alright, back on Serene Shores. Alright, so we've got four treasures up here in the cave and something over here. Uh, wait, we already cleared the cave, that's engulfed castle. Uh, we have a few treasures on the sand castle and the cave with the disco. And we have a few treasures over here and this entire area is unexplored. So I would say we're actually gonna go over here and finish off that one first, shall we? We have so many Pikmin now. We need to really be careful with the purple ones though. We only have 10 and we don't have the purple on yet, so... If we lose any, I'm gonna rewind. Uh, that's not the right way. Ah, okay. Hi, what's that? Okay, so... Just as a quick note... Ah, okay, it's just... Um, I've seen that people keep somehow unsubscribing. I mean, that's okay if you don't like my content, but I would actually appreciate you at least staying subscribed, even if you don't watch my content. I mean, you don't have to if you don't want to. That's totally fine. Honestly. Oh, that's a blue dweevil. And... There is a... Uh, hold on, what's the shortcut settings? Homesick signal, eyeless alert. There they are. Good thing the Pikmin are pretty fast if you call them with the eyeless alert. You can really see the difference in, like, blossoming pigment versus... Okay, that's the big one. Oh no, wait, it's a small one. This guy's not very strong, especially since you can freeze him now. Oh, that's very useful. We might wanna have our purple pigment eat, drink that. Okay, great. I I thought there was a treasure here. Apparently there wasn't. Hmm, okay, there was... Oh, there's a rubber duck here. Okay. Take it away. Okay, there's a path down here to the entrance of Engulfed Castle. Ooh, there's a whip tongue bull ball. These things are really annoying. Okay, if you don't attack them fast enough... Yeah, again, Ice Pikmin are probably the strongest thing. You only need 30 to... Is that an ocarina? Oh, it is. You only need like 30 of them to... Oh, a Dandori. To freeze any enemy, essentially. I mean, except ice enemies. These leaflings, they're all over the place, huh? Today, Dandori. We Dandori. Tomorrow, we Dandori more. Well, um, I'm gonna take care of some other stuff first, especially taking care of that blue weevil before any of you attack. I didn't know weevils could be in the overworld. And he's dead. Perfect. The rest of the path should be fine. Yeah, I can see the onion from here. That's alright. Yeah, so technically with subscribers, I don't really care how many subscribers I have. I'm just having some fun playing video games right here. But I would really like to reach 500 by the end of the year. So 147 right now because two people unsubscribed in the last few days. So 147 throughout the rest of the year. Which would be really cool, to be honest. Um, okay, there they go with the Dreevil. 
hold on. Uh, the next treasure is over here. It's also another. Oh, it's uh, for digging. Right. I know my commentary isn't the best and all, but I would just kind of appreciate having a few more subs. You know? Gives me the feeling that I'm actually doing something useful instead of just playing video games all the time. Okay, what are they digging up there? It's. Oh, it's a mango, I think. I don't think the purple pigment need to do that. Oh, it was already 12. Okay. We've still got another treasure over here. Good thing I got the treasure gauge plus. That, that'll help me a lot. <sighs> Good thing I cleared the engulfed castle. Carl arrived at the destination. Okay, send out everyone, including Oachi, since Oachi has an amazing uh, digging ability now. I mean, look at how much it... No, we don't need like 30 uh, purple pigment carrying this thing. Okay. That's a peach or something similar like that to that. Okay, let's check. We can. We have to go back here and we have to carry the melon as well. There's a cave over here. There's the um, disco cave over there, and this entire area is unexplored. But we've cleared out this section, and we'll take on the Dandori battle now. Why does that have sparkles and that doesn't? Maybe because I didn't lose pigment there? Who knows? Tropical picking series. Okay, we can still dig up, uh, dig around at this spot. Oh, new gear is available too. Nice. More stuff. I'm gonna accompany them back. Oh, technically I don't need to. But I should wait until it informs me that everything has been transported off. Otherwise it'll just lie around and we'll have to go back and pick it up. That'll be annoying. Okay, they have transported these things. Treasure collected. Okay, fine. In we go. Whee! Time for another test tubs. Time for another Dendori. Challenge. Hmm. I'm not entirely sure how much I'll get to do today. Oh, you can rotate the camera. This is my cave. You are here to done Dory. Drain, drain, drain some more. Let's get him. Okay, we have rock and water pigment. Show me your best done Dory. Oh, that's something for the water pigment. Okay, they have to dig something up. Oh, there's more water pigment here. Um. Wait, the rock pigment can walk back around. Oh, there's more rock pigment here. Okay, great. Also, there's some kind of thing that we can pull out of the ground. Oh, it's a rubber duck. What a drain. Oh, not here. Uh, hold on. I'm gonna send Oachi to take this thing. Sadly, I can't call the water pigmen. <gasps> oh, that's so the rock pigmen can go back here. Okay, that's great. Gathering pigmen. Get him! <sighs> Come on, just take him. Take him, take him. Alright. Oachi is doing his job. Alright, there's rock pigmen fighting a small crab. Gonna have to call all of you here. The small crab is but a nuisance. And it's dead. One, two, three. Uh, 
Perfect. The problem is we can't access that until we drain the water or we have more water pigment. Repeat done, Dory. For good practice. Oh wait, you're right. Down this idler's alert. Oh, they're not idling around. Uh, hold on. Transport more and more. I really need to open up this wall. Perfect. And now I can have the one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Very nice. Uh, disband. No, I actually wanted to have or Archie come with me. So I can pluck the water pigment. Don't leave pigment standing idle. Yeah, I don't want the rock pigment to drown though. Okay, now I can pick the rock pigment back up. And I think... Yep, that's the last pile of nuggets. We can go through here. Okay, that's a yellow volleywog, I think. Steady progress is also good, don't worry. I know, I think he's just saying the same thing over and over. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, got that. Oh, this boat for 12 Pikmin. Oh, the wrong one rock pigment is having a bit of trouble. Oh, it's perfectly 12 pigment. Oh, there's... Division of labor. Oh, no. Wait, why are they going over here? Yeah. Okay, I don't know if any died, but I'm pretty sure some did. Okay, there's still some stuff to do here. But the gold is being steadily worked at. Okay, the five Pikmin are working on this. Why are they going around here? Oh, because... Oh, I'm so dumb. I should have sent water Pikmin to do this. Because the rock Pikmin can't go through there. I think this is exactly seven. Yeah? Okay, I think I'm pretty much off well. This is nearly everything. Right? I'm not sure if I've gotten everything, but it looks like it. Okay, just have the uh, last few water pigment do this. Pick up the last few nuggets. You beat my record. Huh, very good to know. One minute left. But, we also already got silver. We collect the last few things. The rubber ducky. The sponge and the bit of gold. Oh, there's 20 left. Where? I've never seen such dumb Dory. Uh, I have the feeling that I've missed something. Yeah, I'm not gonna get platinum. Uh, wait, where's the last thing, actually? I've, I've checked everything. There's everything... Wait. Oh, no. No, wait. It's I'm dumb. No! There's a pile of gold nuggets? I didn't see that. You know what? Just because that's so easy to get, I'm just gonna do it again. I'm really stubborn when it comes to stuff like that. Okay, one, two, three. Alright, so... Again... Pluck the rock pigment. Uh, get the spawn. Pluck the rock pigment. Have Archie transport this off. And... Pull out whatever is under there. I think it was a rubber duck, yeah. But, before I transport that big thing off... 
get more get more rock pigment. Also, it only requires ten, so only have ten rock pigment. Do that instead of all fifteen. Saves time. Okay, call back and have the seven rock pigment defeat this crab right here. Then have them work on this wall while I pluck those blue pigmen. Uh, okay. We'll also start work on this wall. Hmm, okay, there's still some pigmen fighting over here. Oh, wait a second. The rock pigmen are only gonna do that? Okay, Oachi is back, so we are able to break through this wall now. Second time around is a bit easier because you know what to do. Alright, so we got this. Okay, we also pick up the blue pigmen. We throw them. Oh, um, I managed to... Get him! Come on! Yeah! Get all the blue pigment together. Get one over here, one over here. Oh, you're probably supposed to do that with all pigment that you can get. And Owachi. Alright. Repeat Dandori for good practice. So we pick up the pigmen that don't transport, that don't go back. And Oachi, of course. Then we... Go over here, have the rock pigmen defeat this guy. What? Wait, how did one die? Uh, right, uh, pluck some more rock pigment before I do anything dumb. I'll just take down these two. And... Have them do this. Then pick up this gold stash. Is that all? Yes, of course. Get those pigmen. Let the rock pigmen carry the little rubber duck off. Then we can easily collect the next few pigmen, carry off the boat, and check off the last few treasures and be done with this part of the metal. <sighs> okay. That was just a little stupid that I missed out on that one pile of gold. Oh, there's still some stuff here, right. Uh, first of all, transport of the rubber ducks. Get all the pigment back together. Have the rock pigment transport this off and instead of the blue pigment. We'll trans let the rock pigmen transport that off. And those blue pigmen will have to make exactly two trips to get this gold mound. And I think that's all. Yeah, that looks like everything. Oh, I forgot we can jump over this, right? Ah, uh, wait, we can just... To shorten the duration. Let 12 more blue pigment do that. There's one more gold piece left, but it should be fine. You are a Dandori genius. Okay, that should be alright. Alright. Last bits of gold transport off. And... 
There he is. And done. Okay, sorry that took longer than I expected. But I managed. Perfect. 170. Bonus time. Platinum medal. Good stuff. So incredible. And then he gives us some raw material and passes out. I just wanted a platinum medal because I'm pretty stubborn when it comes to stuff like that. And honestly, it's quite fun just working out all the things you need to do simultaneously. On the topic of simultaneously, I'm pretty sure it's... You know, it's gonna take us a bit until it's midday, so we might as well go back to the sand castle and check off the treasures there. Okay. Accept, and have... Okay, 50% of the area. Actually, 56. Good. Okay, there's some hydro jelly over here with some raw material back there. There's all of this and two caves that we haven't explored yet. The disco and... All of this. So how about I'm just gonna auto walk myself over here. Alright, so the plan now is to simply get as much as possible and I hope we can be done tomorrow at least. Oh, is that... Okay, that's one of these annoying fish. I don't want to fight them in the water. But we need to build the bridge for... to get the Moai. <sighs> Wait, how much does it... 100 ice pigment. Okay, question answered. We can't do that. Hmm. There's definitely some treasure back here. There's still fish here, but I don't think we need to transport them all. Hmm. Okay, that apparently here. Oh, it's some more rubber ducks. Okay. There's also a paper bag up here. I mean, it's a very minor shortcut. Oh, is it? Oh, it doesn't look like a minor shortcut. Also, how do I get... Oh, I could just walk over here. Ah, I just wanted to say, like... Okay, we have to wait for the water to go down, but that's soon gonna be the case. Also, there's the next cave. Okay, got the leafling, unreadable data, and push the paper bag off the edge. Very good. This way we can access... Seafloor Resort. What a beautiful scenery. When I'm surrounded by water, I can't help but feel at one with the sea. Sadly, there aren't many places to land here, so non-swimming pigmen aren't able to do much. At least I got to pretend I was on vacation for a while, right? Okay, Seafloor Resort doesn't seem to be that bad. Okay. It should be midday any second now. Any second now. Nope, there's no enemy in here. And midday. Perfect. Meaning, I can now finally have my exactly 10 purple Pikmin transport off this gigantic melon. And of course, Orochi is gonna help. I wonder, can I have more than 200? I can! And it's actually gonna speed up the process by a whole lot. So, you can have up to a thousand carry strength with a hundred purple pigment. That's crazy. But we don't have that many, so I doubt we'll get, ever get that many. Except if we get the purple onion. I know it's in the game somewhere. Okay, the water has been lowered, so I can organize myself a few water and ice pigment and take out 
Oh wait, no, I can just build the bridge. Right. When they've transported the melon. I can just start on doing that now instead of waiting a lot around a while. Alright, good thing we got the melon today because that would have taken us... You can only do it in the afternoon, so it would have been annoying if we didn't get to do it. Alright, or Ochi? Or is it is it Ochi or Oachi? Well, actually, it wasn't that smart to send out purple pigment to do this. Alright, so... Okay, it takes 80 to freeze this over. 80 ice pigment. I'm not sure if there's another flower lick, but there might be in one of the caves. We'll definitely be able to transport off the Moai. It's just about getting at least one or two caves today. Uh, that requires 20, so I'll just let the ice pigment do that. While I check the surroundings. There's one more treasure here, which is the banana. And there's lots of enemies here. There's also a clam with... <gasps> with a flower lick! But we have to do that solely with water pigment. I'm not sure if we can transport off the banana. Oh, wait. Yeah, there's a way up there. But we'll have to do a whole water battle with only water pigment. So, I'm gonna start taking out the enemies right here. Come on. Okay, I can't risk... Oh, it has a second attack that actually eats pigment. But only if you stand right in front of it. <sighs> okay, hopefully none died. Perfect. Have them transport that off. And go back to base, because now I'm taking on Seafloor Resort. We have two more areas to explore. Sandcastle and... Uh, this whole thing back there. Okay. I'm gonna have them transport off this thing and then I'm gonna take on Seafloor Resort. There's a few more treasures probably back here, but there's also Flower Lake, which I really want. And, well, there's one, two, three, four, five, probably six, and the Flower Lake. And two caves. We're not gonna make this today. Sure, if I organize myself better, split up into, o uh, into Ochi and uh, Carl, then I would have been able to make it perhaps, but I'm not that good at Dundoreen, so yeah. Also, Seafloor Resort is gonna take a while, so I don't wanna extend the part too much. I already did the Dundori challenge twice to get platinum. I just want more blue Pikmin in order to, you know, have some helping hands in order to get the Flalik tomorrow. Okay, off to Seafloor Resort, I would say. Hmm, it's starting to get a bit darker, I think. I'm not sure, but it's pretty close to evening, so I think we should go in. Or else we won't be able to uh, finish this whole thing. <laughs> There's one ice pigman who's a bit late to the party. Okay, 23 treasures. Mm, there's also onions in here. So there's either Flardix or a new onion type. That might be the rock onion we've been looking for. I mean, we have literally no rock pigman left since I messed it up. Okay, we have to close off this thing. Uh, 
Uh, there's a few water hazards and a few weird floating jellyfish. Oh, they shatter upon me. Oh dear. Quick, 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 freeze it. Bam. Very nice. Okay. Okay, that's golden here. First destroy the water hazards. I don't know if ice pigmen will be affected by the water hazards, but I'm pretty sure they will. So, transport of the gold. Also got some more ice pigmen. Pigmen, that's neat. That more sushi. Uh, I know that they drop raw materials, so I really don't want to kill them. Okay, those are Fury Blowhawks, so we have to be a bit careful about them, but the check is fine. How much? 100, yeah, okay. I guess it would take a few more Pikmin. Alright. Water Pikmin are essential here. I think Ice Pikmin aren't able to go through water like Water Pikmin are, they're just able to freeze it. Okay, that clears off this area. There's... Okay, there may be stuff in the corners. Wait, are the ice people actually able to... Yeah, they are able to go over there, but they have to take a bit of a long way. We need water pigment for that too. Mm -hmm. Okay, it doesn't look like there's much on the corners of the whole cave though. Is that an aquarium? This is an aquarium, look at it! I mean, if you... it doesn't... it isn't too clear, I mean... You know, but right over... oh, there's a flavic too. But right over there, there's these big aquarium things. The big uh, fish tanks. That's cool. Okay, spring does now off, that's useful. Um, we're gonna have the blue pigmen take that down. Ah, damn, now I left one up there. Oh, he's smart enough to follow me through this way. Okay, now we can get to exploring the upper layer. There's a strawberry up here. Oh wait, we should actually have the ice pigmen do that. And crash through the wall. We can finally get another flower lake. Okay, wait until this thing... And it's dead. Yeah, as soon as it's frozen, it's dead, so... I can't do anything about that. Oh, that's all treasure here, but not everything. We haven't collected the flower lake. Wait, there were Pikmin in there? Loads of them, apparently. Okay, that's the exit to the next area. I love the fact that you can throw Pikmin so quickly. Okay. Oh, there's water Pikmin over there, too. It's always useful picking up the Pikmin. It tells me that all treasures have been collected, but, you know, the Flardic is pretty valuable. If there's a second, f if there's a second onion, or if there's supposed to be one, okay, we've got 75. 
Oh, we've got a few water pigment and a few ice pigment. That's good. Let's see how many areas there are. I would guess three, though there might be four. I mean, it's 23 treasures. Four. Okay, and there's only one onion, sadly. We've gotten six out of 23 treasures. I'm not entirely sure if there's gonna be a boss here. I mean, you know, I don't really know that. Okay, we have to lower the iron fences. There must be a castaway. Okay, that's our first rescue here. There's a thermal gate to begin with, so let's take the ice pigment and send them out. There's a bubble hazard, that's definitely something. I think that's non-elemental essentially, which means that, you know... Okay, they should be done pretty quickly though. Okay, we should just take that out. No, it's gonna drop Pikmin. Fine, come here. We have to freeze the... Uh, what is it? Peckish Aristocrab? Okay, we have to uh, be a little more careful this time around. A, because of these bubble hazards, because they can easily trap Pikmin. And B, because of what well, the Peckish Aristocrab, which can eat Pikmin in a very short time. Yeah! I was close. Wow, smart. I'm really not the smartest person, am I? Okay, let's see. And goes over and dead. Always good to have some more flower pigment. Oh, damn. Okay, let's see whether we get- no, 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 no. Okay, the bubbles will pop eventually, I'm pretty sure of that. Oh, that's a... Ultra Spicy Spray. Let's go over here. <gasps> There's the rescue! Or the castaway. Oh, they're not able to use the... Okay, it's instantly dead. Get this thing. Okay, we should take on the Peckish Aristocrab now. I just wanted to pick up those Pikmin again. <sighs> they didn't make it! No! Oh, the Ice Pikmin tried to carry them. Tried to help them. But they couldn't, <laughs> because they don't walk through water. I'm not entirely sure why that is. I mean, I don't know. I mean, technically ice swims on water. Okay, one, two, three. Perfect, you're actually just able to rush through. Good, now let's get those. Oh no! That's a fired weevil. That's two fired weevils! Shit. No, I don't really care about that right now. Checking the ID info. And it's Frise from Inohe. A dedicated composer traveling with a famous opera singer and a TV crew hoping to find inspiration for upcoming project. Okay. Okay, we have to be quick about this. Get him! 
Dweevers are luckily not that strong, so you can just ram them if you have a lot of Pikmin. But they're extremely powerful if you're not careful. Okay, I thought I was gonna lose Pikmin here. That would have been quite unfortunate. Is there anything else here? There's some ice pigment here. Good. Alright, let's see. We do have to take on the Package Aristocrab now. I mean, there's no way around it. We have to take it down either way, and I'm pretty sure it has a treasure. I also have to collect this button, I guess. I mean, just attacking it from behind is so quicker than it. Freezing it over and then smacking it is fairly easy. It didn't even have a treasure. It was just there. Okay, let's collect all our Pikmin. We've got 80 Pikmin now. Pikmin are having a bit of trouble, apparently, with the gates. Okay. I'm pretty sure the uh, button for lowering the fences is right over here. Oh yeah, right. And... I have to freeze this over. And destroy it. Perfect. Yeah, there is the button, but... Wait a second. We can't get up there. Can the Pikmin trigger that? Yes, apparently they can. <laughs> the stream of Pikmin. Okay, very good. I think that should be everything for this area. I hope at least. And since we've collected the rescue and uh, the onion, we should have everything now, and that should be halfway done with this thing. Can yeah, I actually look at it? This looks like beach, but it's actually an aquarium. Though so there doesn't seem to be anything in those aquariums. Okay. Oh, there's still a treasure around. I missed something. But where? Also, I don't like the fact that what that OG stops so suddenly. <gasps> Over there! Do you see it? Those tiny squid figures. Yeah! Huh! <laughs> Crazy! What would happen if you had a hundred Pikmin and then more Pikmin joined your squad in a cave? I mean, you entered the cave with a hundred Pikmin. Would you actually have more than a hundred Pikmin? That would be interesting. I mean, a hundred red Pikmin are able to take down enemies extremely quickly. Same goes for, you know, a hundred Pikmin of any kind if they face a specific enemy. Even a hundred flying or winged Pikmin, which are not very strong. Okay, that's all. And that thing is back here. Good. We've gotten it all. And now, time to keep going. We only have two more areas to go. Or layers, technically. Subfloors, whatever. Oh, you can actually see the shadow of the SS Beagle uh, fly down towards that thing. Okay, we probably have one more rescue and ten more treasures in total. So that... I'm pretty sure that if there's a boss, there's gonna be nine treasures here. And if there's no boss in the last area, there's gonna be five treasures here. Maybe we have three rescues. Who knows? Alright, Seafloor Resort. Or Resort, I'm not sure. Level... Sub-level three. Okay, let's see. There's three treasures over here already. Oh, it's something. Okay. Take down this wall. And done. A 
Okay. Oh, there's some more blue pigment down there. Oh no, that's the homesick signal. Hmm, okay. Uh, that's one of these... Oh, that's a puffer fish. Okay, another bubble hazard. I'm gonna hold off on this from this area for now. Ooh, there's a big one here. Again, same tactic as before. Approach from the back or from the side. Okay, that was close. It didn't drop anything though. Maybe it, it got it something? Nothing? Really? Oh, that's fake teeth. Okay. That's surprising that we find something like that here. Okay, another jellyfish thing. We can just... Oh dear. Yeah. That has a... Oh no. No, it sped us out back down here. Shit. Uh... Oh dear. No! Oh, oh, she can't go through there. Please don't tell me they're gonna be digested quickly. Because we're gonna have to leg it all the way over here. Oral augments. Yes. What? <laughs> Wait, what? They died? Oh, you're joking, right? Oh, damn it. Also, I don't know why we lost so many pigmen. Just to that one jellyfish or what? Ah, damn it. Okay, they built the bridge. Those... Help us get that thing down. You break down the wall. Three, two, one. Come on. Okay. The thing is, I don't want to lose pigmen, especially a uh, pigmen, especially not the ice pigmen, which I just sent into their demise. That was stupid. I could have, I could have fairly easily gotten them back. But the high flying pink jellyfish, apparently, we're having none of that. Are you kidding me? Now the ice pigmen are down in the water. At least half of them. No, wait, that was dumb. We shouldn't send out the ice pigmen if they're only hope against those flying things. Um, at least the ice pigmen are immune to drowning, I guess. It's flying above the water again? Of course, that's how it... We have to somehow get Ochi back here, but I have no clue how to do that. I don't think they can even carry off the toothbrush without having not. Why do some Pikmin just go back to the treasure, which I just told them not to get? Apparently, I have to take on the underwater section first. 
Ähm okay, that's annoying. Great. Okay, disband. Leave everyone but the blue pigment here. Because with the help of the blue pigment, you please focus on the. Thank you. We'll be able to attack this th thing from behind and take it down. I don't like those puffer fish. Now. Okay, at least 40 blue pigments seem to be enough to one shot it before it can actually extend its toxic spikes. Okay. Get some more material. Okay, we have 15 left. Which is enough to get these things. <gasps> oh, more blue pigment. Great. Oh, we need blue pigment because only they can collect treasures underneath the water surface. Kinda makes sense though. Paleontology series? What? That's not paleontology. Okay, let's see. We have to fight the jellyfish at some point. Okay, how much do we have to... Oh, there's some stuff back here. Aren't those those swords that you can... Yeah, that you can carry with one pigment. Great. We're missing one? Oh, there he is. Don't know where he went, but alright. <sighs> okay, same thing. We need to lower the fences now. This is the first time we've nearly gotten a hundred pigmen in our party at once. Ouch. Okay, there were only a few, very few pigmen that didn't have. Okay, we need to be careful with this thing. Just chucking ice pigment at it will help. Yep, and it's it. Very good. Uh, quick question. How do I open up the gates? Oh, there's a path up here. Problem solved. Oh gee, you're just gonna... Yep, perfect. Alright, three, two, one, break down the wall. So that, that's the path to the next area. I do think there will be a small boss, because, well, there seem to be quite a few treasures here, so, yeah. And, one. Just have to lure this guy into the open. Charge up. And then, oh dear. Okay. We have so many Pikmin at this point that they always manage to take him down. Great! They'll be freed eventually. Alright, I think the fake teeth are the last thing that we need to collect for this area. Are they? I mean... 
Okay, there's some raw material back here, which I'll pick up, all right? But there's apparently not much more here. We are literally inside an aquarium. Interesting. Oh, there's one more treasure at least. Oh wait, that might be the fake teeth still. We haven't transported them all fully. Okay, that's the raw material. And that's all. 14,000 sparklium. Okay, that's everything here. And I think the last rescue should be on the last on the last floor. Wait, we're missing one Pikmin again. Why was he over there? Oh, because of the bubbles, right. Alright. Time for the last area. And I think that should be the last thing we do today. And I hope we can at least get the last bits tomorrow and finish off the Serene Shores by doing the Disco Cave, which I've avoided. I should have, you know, I, I thought I would have avoided the Water Rave Castle, the Engulfed Castle, but, you know. <sighs> Good. Oh, that's a big guy. There must be a castaway in it. Uh, do we really need more ice pigment? Of course we do, we don't have the ice onion yet. Boom. Okay. That is a very big guy, in fact. Okay, let's hope we don't get crushed. Okay, he does. <laughs> you need a hundred ice pigment to freeze that. But you don't need a hundred ice pigment to freeze him. Also, I'm surprised that they don't get crushed. Take him down! Okay, that didn't work. But he's essentially just a bigger version with more health of the yellow Wally Wobs. Or Wally Wobs, I don't know. And he's dead. We even got two of the um, Ultra Spicy Spray. Cool. Great, one Ice Pigment has been standing on the water. I has managed to stand in the water and block everything else. Well, that's the last treasure of this cave. We just need to rescue the rescue. Somewhere. <gasps> oh, under there. <laughs> Gimme, gimme, serious. Okay. And that should be the last thing we need to collect. Well, last rescue for this cave, I guess. There's never more than two, I think. I, have we had three yet? No, not really, uh, did we? Alright, let's check another ID. Kaya from Nechki. Ah, the Planetary Science Club member. Another one. A student. Great. And that's all. Also, we've completed another side quest. Great. Alright, that's everything for this cave. Great. And I thought we wouldn't be able to finish that. Okay, that a lot of more time passed than I thought. Would, but we should be able to end the day now with quite a bit more stuff collected. 
Seafloor Resort. Two rescues. Uh, that means we won't be able to upgrade pup anything for OG today or tomorrow, I guess. But, you know, next part. 1,161 Sparklium. Uh, 1,661. I'm apparently not able to read. Great! We didn't even lose Pikmin. We got 20 new water and 10 new ice Pikmin. 100%. 14,420 Sparklium. And I'd call that a successful day. Well, I really hope that we can, f that I can finish off the Serene Shores tomorrow, considering that there's not that much left. I mean, the timer should start so I can check off everything that I have to still collect. And aside from that, I think it's nearly done for today. Except if there's like lots of time left. <laughs> but we nearly entered the cave when there was barely any time left before the timer. Yeah, right, the Flalik. I forgot about that. It was a bit ago. And there we go. Number of Pikmin increased by number 10. Meaning we can have 70 with us now. Okay, we've gotten 71%. And there's not much missing. The Disco Cave. Three treasures back here, a Flalik. Uh, so there's five treasures at least. Maybe six. A Flalik and a cave. Okay. Great. And that concludes day 12. Or that was day 13. I think it's day 13, right. And we'll be able to buy so much more stuff from Russ tomorrow. As long as we don't need bombs, I won't buy them because, you know, we don't really need them. Right. Day 13, yeah, I wanted to say. We've gotten three rescues today, great. 26 until now, which is already a lot, and we're not even in the fourth area. Loads of new stuff. We have 2,671 Sparklium in total. Very good. 71%. No Pikmin lost again, but I'm pretty sure we lost some Pikmin on the way in total. 319 raw material and a very successful day. No, halt, come no closer. Captain, what is it? What's wrong? They're here and there's a shepherd. Pigment, so many pigment at this rate will be crushed. Uh, Captain, I'm not seeing any pigment. What? I think it was just a nightmare. <laughs> it's a nightmare. Pigment disobey orders and suddenly start king overrunning the entire crew. Yeah, that's actually quite a concern, honestly. Well, I think the Pikmin are quite kind enough, so they'll leave us alone if we need to be. Alright, successful day. Thanks for watching, I guess. Um, have a nice day, morning, evening, afternoon, lunch, whenever you're watching this. Although it would be an honor if you watched this while eating. And yeah, stay healthy, stay safe, and I'll see you in the next one, which might be today too. Goodbye.